Weavery project focuses on underserved communities and the marginalized Roma communities are one of those in which this project is very much needed. We have a very low vaccination rates overall in general population and we assume that the vaccination rates in uh, marginalized Roma communities are even lower. The um, most relevant uh, barrier is uh, lack of uh, linguistically appropriate uh, uh, information uh, for uh, Roma people in a marginalized uh, uh, community. Uh, because healthcare uh, providers uh, uh, struggle with uh, providing basic healthcare, such as uh, uh, treatment uh, of sick uh, uh, children, uh, mandatory checkups, uh, mandatory vaccination uh, for children uh, from marginalized uh, uh, communities. Collaboration between Pavel Josef Shafarik University and the rest of the consortium members is very fruitful. We identified uh, barriers uh, which should be addressed with a priority and our colleagues from the consortium identified promising interventions uh, that might be very helpful to overcome the barriers we identified in our context. Thankfully, we have already a health mediation program in Slovakia called Healthy Region. So we have a functioning network of Roma health mediators who are operating directly in the field and they are trying to help people overcome uh, barriers in access to healthcare and also to raise awareness. So now uh, we are in the stage when we will focus on development of uh, intervention which aims to uh, overcome these barriers. The expected impact yes. to have better data about our general population, about most vulnerable, marginalized and Roma population. Second is to improve health literacy, which lead to better vaccination acceptance and to better vaccination coverage of these vulnerable groups. Third is when we increase this vaccination and we decrease spreading of this uh, type of viruses uh, uh, across community. And fourth, we still have a very complicated negotiation process with our regulators and stakeholders about the reimbursement of vaccination. And we need the data for health technology assessment. And when we will have this data, our position for negotiation will be better. Health is one of the assets that we need to protect and we need to help people in vulnerable positions to preserve their health. Within this project, within the River Eve project, we need to listen carefully to all of these people because uh, if we want to cover the complexity of this issue, uh, we need to be open to all uh, opinions.